Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name's Heather if you're new here. I'm an artist and I'm from Minnesota. <laughs> this video today is all about my second convention ever. It was always a goal of mine to table at conventions, sell my art IRL. I did my first convention back in August, I think. There's a video up on my channel about that. And this is my second convention, which was in Bloomington, Minnesota. It was called the Artist Alley MN. And it's a new convention. It's run by a bigger convention called 2D Con. This was the first year they did this convention. So it was pretty small, but it was still like an amazing experience. And I absolutely love tabling at conventions. I'm already signing up to table at other ones next year. So, so this convention you're about to see was back on October 22nd. So there's a little bit of Halloween vibes going on in this video. Listen, I know we're heading towards Christmas, but hopefully my year round Halloween people are out there and can appreciate just uh, extending the season just a little bit. <laughs> if you're an artist and you're planning to table at a convention, I hope you enjoy this. Hope it gives you a little bit of inspiration, a little motivation, but if not, hopefully you'll still enjoy just a fun little life vlog. Leave a comment letting me know what city you're in so maybe I can like look up some conventions that are in your city and maybe I can go to the next year or something. I don't know. So from my first table back in August, I had some things set up. So the first thing I need to do is kind of rearrange that and put my new products on. Okay, see you at the end. I never got it what you have to go. I guess this world's too slow for you. I think there's beauty in the gray, the cold, but you just want the gold. And there's no way I can beat it cause I got no chance, no chance when it comes to her. She got the glitter and the fame and I just wasn't enough for you Okay, so I've laid out everything I'm gonna bring. I don't know how much room I'm gonna have, but I'm going to try to spread out a little bit more. I have all my stickers out here. Um, I noticed last time that I was at um, my first convention, people were really gravitated towards like whatever was on the table and they were touching things and like wanted to pick stuff up. So I wanna give people an opportunity to do that. Cause last time I just had my stickers like on a sheet like this hung up and I feel like people didn't really notice them right away and there's obviously not room on that piece of paper to put any more stickers on and I don't really want to make a whole nother one so I'm just gonna have them out like this and I feel like people will gravitate towards them more that way anyways then I've got like a tote bag on the side over there but I'll also probably display like a whole one maybe hanging down from the um table I don't know yet yeah I'm just gonna bring a bunch of accessories <laughs> little lamps and lights and doodads and stuff and yeah we'll just set up everything when we get there i think that'll be this this is good oh it's two o'clock okay we'll see you at the convention it's saturday october 23rd and we're all packed up we're ready to go okay here we are we're at the hilton Woo! there's like this wedding party of like all these beautiful basic Minnesota girls. They're in the lobby right now. It looks like they're getting ready to go, but then there's all these like freaking Halloween people walking around next to them. Like, you know, it's just uh, two different vibes. We're in like a ballroom at this hotel and it's pretty um, quiet. I don't know. I'm gonna try to vlog as much as I can, but I'm kind of embarrassed. Okay, um, let's go in. <laughs>
struggling to compete. <laughs> Hope to see you here. Hi. Hi. Just blankets. Yeah, thank, you. Thank, you. <laughs> thank you. So stickers are four each or buy two, get one free. Hi, Dad. Hi, how's it going? Good. Hi, welcome to the Umbrella booth. I'm working on a drawing of the Ghoul Boys. Which boys? The Ghoul Boys. The Ghoul Boys. Uh huh. Nice. Thanks so much. Thank you. Where'd mom go? Shopping. Oh, nice. Oh, I see her. I'm gonna spy on her. Mom, I see you. She's buying something. She's buying a bag. So my grandparents live just down the street from where we are and I told my mom to go get them and bring them down. They are 90 years old, but um, I think they can handle walking around the room. Okay, we just hit our $100 mark, which is all I could ever hope to make since the con was $100. We did it. Good job, everybody. Okay, I think Julian is on his way. He's gonna get me Chipotle. I really love doing conventions. Like, I wanna do a lot next year. I wanna travel. I wanna go to different states, different places. Let me know if you have a convention in your city that you think I would like. Yeah. Okay, that's like a really old video of mine. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh my gosh. It's been going pretty well today. It's a little quiet. This is um, the convention's first year. They're ran by like a bigger convention, which is called 2D Con. But this is their first year doing this artist alley in this location. So kind of fun experiment to be one of the first. Also, everybody keeps asking about my earrings and they do turn on but they're slowly dying. Maybe I'll just leave them on and see if they, see if they stay. Julian's here now. Look what he brought me. Chipotle! Chipotle is my life. The newly engaged couple is here. Ooh. So Ashley and Cody just stopped by. They already own everything in my shop though, so that's what friends are for. What do you guys have, huh? Huh? Do you guys have one of everything? <laughs> that Chipotle was real good. They didn't have half the things. Okay, yeah, wanted. that's true. They didn't have corn. What kind of chipotle doesn't have the corn? It's they didn't corn. Have corn or salsa. Or the salsa. <laughs> but it was fine. It was still good. Anyways, I'm working on another little drawing right now for Peachtober. I'm gonna try to finish it before we leave today. What time is it right now? It's like three. Oh my god, it's almost four o'clock. Oh, <gasps> cute. Who's in there? Here's where we're at at 4.30. Here's all the orders from today. Yay! Oh, I just got a sale in my online store. Okay, great. Okay, here's how my 
Jerron came out for Peach Tober tomorrow. So Julian just left. He's going back because we're dog sitting right now. So he's going home. I can't even express how nice everybody is. Everybody's so nice. So I sold out of the Don't Honk or Cry bumper stickers. This pin did really well today. This sticker did really well. And of course my little Halloween stickers did well too. Oh. Sonic Boys did good too. Sold a couple tote bags, sold a couple prints. People like the Pokemon ones, of course. And a lot of people like to do the, I do buy two, get one free stickers when I do cons. When I do cons, my second one ever. And so that's something I'd highly recommend is to buy two, get one free sticker. And have a little freebie sticker pile next to your business cards. Productive day, I got my Peachtober done for tomorrow and I worked on the cool boys a little bit more. I drew in the ghosts today. I did the haunted house back here. There's someone in the window. <laughs> Thanks to everyone who showed up. Some people from Instagram showed up. That's really exciting. I love um, meeting people IRL. So that's fun. I love my little Twin Cities community. Look who's here, it's Megan and Mark. Hey. It's Mark's birthday. Hey. All right, it's um, almost 6.30. We're wrapping up here and I have to poop. <laughs> Julian and I are going to a party, so the fun never ends, guys. Oh, these are still glowing very, very dimly. You couldn't see them in the light, but you can see them now. Overall, sorry it's so dark. I, I don't, I don't really want anyone to see me. Overall, super fun. I love conventions. I want to do more. Like I said, this was only my second convention ever, and it was a pretty small one, but it was like so worth it. I just, I love meeting other artists at their booths. I love seeing people come up to my booth and like react in person to my work. I'll give some final thoughts and break down on like how things went. Okay, what a day. I just, like I've said a million times, I love tabling. I love conventions. I love selling my art in person. It's just so fun and rewarding to meet people in real life who have either never seen your art before or they've only seen it online and now they get to see it in person. I totaled up the amount that I made that day, not excluding the $100 table fee. I can't remember how much it was. I think it was like 600 something. I'm gonna put the number here. This is how much I made, which I feel like is really good for how small the convention was and how new it was as well. Thank you, thank you, thank you if you came in person and showed up. And yeah, like I've said, let me know if there are any conventions in your city or just any conventions you know of that you think maybe I would like. And before I go, of course, one last big shout out to my patrons. I love you all so much. Thank you for supporting me and thank you for watching this video. I will see you all next week. Bye!